three now, and that humidity looks low, but remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. <laughs> Mr. Toad? Oh, shit! Big B! Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I'll get it. I just stepped out of the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. I've heard enough of your excuses, Toad. This is unacceptable. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? Then get it fixed. It's not complicated, Toad. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fuck you now! See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Bigby, before he completely tears up the place! And what exactly do you want me to do? I want you to throw the fucking woodsman out of here, drunk shit. He's been going on like that for hours. Turn this place to dust if you let him. He's in a fucking rage. <laughs> this is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. You're the landlord, Toad. This is something you should be doing. Oh, yeah, that'd be a fair fight. You're the sheriff, Big B, and the man's clearly disturbing the peace. Or whatever a Monday cop would call it. Wait, you're not worried about his axe, are you? I know you two have history, but I'm not worried. Right, of course. Fuck you! I didn't know anyone else was up there. Furry prick of shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get the fuck back inside! You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey, look at me! something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid girl? <clears throat> I'll fucking kill you! 
All right, what's going on here? What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. Woody, this is your last warning. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. <laughs> probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting sick, bitch. I'll fucking put you on the ground. Shut up. Oh, fucking shit. You bugged my jaw, you bastard. And still you talk. Fuck you. Shit. All right, you need to go. I can't go until this deadbeat pays me. For what? I let you slap me around for a while. You're lucky I'm not charging extra. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. What are you doing here? These lips are sealed. He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of stones and threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch! Uh, would you excuse me for a moment? By all means. Come on! Take your time. Toad, you need to get off the street. You don't have your glamour. Apologies for smashing your car, Toad. I'm gutted for you, mate. It's a real shame. But that's not you, is it? Got to play the old man role. <sighs> Some things are more important than your car. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. <laughs> Fucking in there! Come on out, you fucking dog! Oh, what 
Can't be doing that. I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more from me. Mama? He'll be. I'll kill Mama. you. You fucking bitch. Let me help you. He's having a bad day. That makes two of us. I guess it's a good thing fables are hard to kill. Suppose it is. These lips are sealed. Sorry. Hey, you like my ribbon? Beautiful. Thank you. I feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Shit. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. It's not just about you. I can't have him running around the city in the state he's in. Good, because I was just starting to worry it was all about me. That's not what I mean. How much was the OJ? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. Let's see, I've got, uh, it's 20, 40, 7, 8, 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for a sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I am? You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. That's going to leave a mark. Or maybe not. Hey. 
I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. I'll see you around, Wolf. me come over there. Look, I've got an hour of paperwork ahead of me, and I've already had to deal with one asshole tonight, so just... Sorry, Bigby. Didn't mean to be an asshole. Beauty. Hello, Bigby. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd. You're out pretty late. Is there some sort of curfew I don't know about? What's with a third degree? Damn it, I'm late. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Sure. You promise? I promise. Thank you, Bigby. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I... I appreciate it, Bigby. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope. I haven't seen her. Oh. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. 
Something's going on. Thank you. 